Schoolboy Q and Yeet. Who is Yeet? <laughs> Yeet, talk, let's go. <laughs> What's up, you're watching Hive Mind, the most awful show on the internet. My name is Riley Zoom, and my unlawful co-host, Dignan. Give me your money. Please, I have a wife and kids. Okay, I do too, <laughs> okay. I can empathize with there that. There we go, I'm glad we could come to an <laughs> agreement. We are lucky enough to be joined by our friend, content creator, singer, songwriter, and deep sea fisherman, Gabby Bell. I caught a fat grouper the other day, you should have seen it. <laughs> Damn. Today we're doing a good old fashioned popularity contest. This is Guess Which Artist Has More Monthly Listeners on Spotify. Oh no. Here's how this is gonna work. We're gonna get two artists. We're gonna guess which one has more monthly listeners on Spotify on this current day. One point for each one we get right. Me versus Gabby versus Dignan versus you. Donovan Mitchell in Cleveland, Ohio. Spider. <sighs> I'm versus everyone in Ohio. I'm waging war. Before we get into it, make sure you like the video. Subscribe if you want to see more. Go to HiveMindTV.com and check out our merch, including new stuff. And as always, our Patreon and our Cameo are linked in the description if you'd like to support us. Please. I have a video on Spotify. Grant, who's our first matchup? Jay-Z and Lil Baby. Ooh. Kind of the old school versus the new school. Yeah, in a, in a big way. A lot of endorsements for Lil Baby this year. I saw him do like a Dunkin' Donuts thing, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I, you <laughs> saw that right with the Timbit. Yeah. Oh, it was at Tim Hortons. It was? Yeah, no, you're right. It was Tim Hortons. Was or it? was it Dunkin'? It was a donut place, and he did the perfect tr TikTok transition where he held the donut hole up to the screen, mm -hmm. and when he pulled it away, he was holding the whole donut. Unbelievable. Lil Baby has the rock star song. That's not the Post Malone one. The other one. That's the Baby. Fuck. <laughs> So yeah. what song did Lil Baby do? He's got a feature with Drake. Yes, indeed. Yeah, so does Ninja. <laughs> okay. Yeah, well, okay. <laughs> do you know who Jay-Z is, though? Yes. Okay, <laughs> I was just making sure. You haven't been on the show much le recently, man. Yeah, I, I got a lot of better shit to do, to be honest. Tailgate, mostly. It's football season. Yeah, okay, that's fair. I go around and I sell bacon-wrapped uh, bacon at tailgates. <laughs> bacon-wrapped bacon? It's fucking amazing. So dude. what's in the middle? Bacon. <laughs> and what's around the outside? <laughs> Wouldn't that just be like a big clump of bacon? <laughs> I guess you could call it that, but I sell it as bacon wrap bacon. That's better marketing. You sell it at the tailgates? Fuck yeah, I do. Oh, okay. Fill my whole car with it. Use my car as a smoker. You converted your car into a smoker? Yep. Took the seats out and everything, and I lay a little fire under it, and I go to bed in there with it, too. I get smoked out with the bacon. You do look tan. Thank you. <laughs> I guess you <laughs> and I smell like you just blew a candle out. Eh, it smelled more like... Pork. Honestly. Well, well, yeah. It's a big pork smell, right? You smell yeah, the pork? It smells like slow roasted meat. Yeah. So. 44 bucks a log. I can hook it up. Wow. That's pretty good. Three, two, one. I put Lil Baby. Jay Z. I put Lil Baby. It is Lil Baby. Oh, shit. See, we know Grant. It's, 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 the, it's the trick question vibe. I Lil knew Jay Z, it. huge I had legend. A feeling. Lil Baby, new guy. Mm hmm. How many does Lil Baby <sighs> have? Lil Baby has 31,955,799, and Jay-Z has 31,015,997. Wow. Wow. Those are big numbers. Very close, though. It's <laughs> Big goose egg. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Grant, who we got up next? Taylor Swift versus Harry Styles. And this is of today. Right now. The date today. This is important. It is October 27th. Midnight's is out. I don't, ooh, this is tough. This could change any day. I have my opinions. Taylor coming off her biggest album of all time, I believe, selling yeah. 1.5 million copies first week, over 500,000 vinyl copies of her album in one week. It's alarming, honestly, because I've listened to it and I said, how, Sway? Why? And Gabby, your opinion? Oh no, I'm gonna get attacked. <laughs> you love it. I thought it was boring. Oh, that's fine. I'm kind of with you. I like Karma, though. That's probably my favorite track. You played that, and I, I liked that song. I liked it. I I'm, did like that song. I'm a big Swifty fan, okay? So don't yell and scream mm -hmm. at me, please. Thank you. Right. Thank you. You're welcome. Three, two, one. I went with Harry. Taylor. I went with T Swift. It is Taylor Swift. Okay. All right. How close are these shit bags? <laughs> Taylor Swift has 67,594,509 and Mr. Harry Styles has 66,038,184. Grant really finding the the closest matchups he yeah, can find. These good. are within a million of yeah. each other. Oh, man. <laughs> this is what, what I, I got. got. Yeah. That was Never been what I got. Bradley Smith said it best. Who's that? The lead singer of Sublime. Wow, nice. <laughs> there we go. If this was guess the lead singer of the 90s band, we would definitely be losing to you. That's heady as fuck, Who is, Gabby. Who is the head of Steely Dan? Stanley. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Walter Becker. Stanley Steamer. <laughs> Stanley. <laughs> Carpet Stanley. cleaner. Who's next? Schoolboy Q and Yeet. 
Who is he? <laughs> Tom, let's go. <laughs> I was half worried and half excited that this is yeah. the same, same thing. Who is he? <laughs> Turban. Schmonka. What? Twiz. What? Tonka. I was scared. That sounds like a Willy Wonka thing. Turban, Schmunka, Twiz. Who are these Dream SMP members? <laughs> What's going on? He's a white guy that wears a turban and says all these made up words. And his music no, is good. grossly overrated. I know Schoolboy school Q. There you go. There we go. Yeah. That's a real one. I know artist. one song by him that I don't remember the name of. That's fair. Is it that part? That part, that part, that part, that part. Bow. No. Beggars can't be choosers, bitches ain't Chipotle. That part? Maybe. <laughs> Man of the Year? Yeah. 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 That's fun. How do you know? Hey, he, has, he has a couple big songs. That one uh, samples the chromatics from the Drive soundtrack. Great golfer. We literally had a debate on whether you were going to know who he was, <laughs> and it is awesome that you don't. That's my favorite outcome. In what world would I know who he is? He did a Minions. He did the Minions song. Minions. Rich Minion. <gasps> That's the guy! That's, That's the Rich Minions guy. Love right. that you're bridge to you as Minions. Yeah. There are many like you. There are many like you out there. I'm Yeet. a big Minions guy. Yeah, yeah, I know. Three, two, one. Yeet. Schoolboy. Yeet. It is Yeet. Fuck. Wow. I should have gone with the Minions. Yeah, the second you found out Minions, I felt yeah. like that. Yeah. Uh, and what are we looking at numbers wise here? Yeet has 8,780,082. Schoolboy Q has 8,398,737. What? Nail biters today. The, this what? is crazy. Yeah. yeah, I like this. Stream Man of the Year by Schoolboy <laughs> yeah. Q. That's my favorite song of 2015. <laughs> for the Man of the Year. M -m man of the Year. Hey, I'm winning. I know that. <laughs> I'm not. Grant, give us that next one. Beyonce versus Ariana Grande. Oh no. <laughs> Are you familiar? Aren't you a big Ariana Grande fan? I'm a big Ariana fan. Me too. I, I'm Ari Stan. I Ari. love Ari. I mean Arian. I mean Arianator. We got Beyonce Renaissance is out this year. That's it a is. big part of exactly. it. Exactly. Ariana hasn't dropped in a minute. Mm -mm. She ain't. Right. She ain't dropped. Off the scene, honestly. I haven't even been seeing her around at her usual spots. I usually see her at billiards on Wednesday and trivia, dog trivia on Thursday. Well, yeah, she goes to Filligans, right? Yeah, Filligans. Dog trivia, yeah. and then um, I sometimes I catch her at a Rams game too. Oh yeah, her box is right next to mine. Right, I yeah. forgot about that. She used to buy bacon from me. I've never met Beyonce. Neither have I. Strangely, it is. Yeah, it's, it's weird. weird. I, you know, sometimes I think I see her, and then I yeah. don't. It's kind of like a hallucination thing. I don't know. Hatman type scenario with it, Beyonce. Yeah, it's kind of weird. I'm like, is that you? Mm. But it, it never is. <laughs> you ever take so much Benadryl that you see Beyonce? Yeah. <laughs> Three, two, one. Queen B. Beyonce. Beyonce Knowles. It is Ariana Grande. No. There we go. This is another little trick. None of us got a point there. What are the what's the difference? Ariana's got 52,756,685 and Queen B has 48,294,121. Mm. Should have gone with my queen. I know Ariana is like top 10 most streamed on Spotify, but I thought Beyonce would be up there because of the new album. That's Me what too. I assumed too. Yeah. Me too. Mm -hmm. And we assumed wrong. Logic mm -hmm. is uh, no longer the route to victory. He's no longer the route to the suicide hall line either. So I think they literally changed the number. They changed the number? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Well, they got the new hotline now, the three digit one. Yeah, it might route oh, to the new yeah. one, but he has to make a new song. I was going to say, you should make a new song with the yeah. three three number thing. Mm -hmm. And then after the number say, I just want to die, because that will make me not want to die. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. I mean, if successful, amazing rapper Logic wants to die, mm -hmm. what am I doing over yeah, here? Yeah, what am I doing? Yeah, terrible thoughts. Yeah, farting so around, driving around in my stupid fucking car. Yeah. Yeah, so dumb. Picking up my dog's poop. I Come love on. picking up my dog's poop, though. Really? Well, it's the texture. And it, I, I have a bag on, so like I can feel it, but I don't. But you're not touching it. it. Yeah, it doesn't get under my mm -hmm. nails or nothing. Because mm. it's been under my nails before. I Yeah, I got that from kind yeah. of the way you said it. The bag makes it better. Yeah. That was a new thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. New edition. New edition? Oh, you do know. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Candy wait. girl. You know, new edition. No. Really? So let's pretend that I knew the reference. Bobby Brown's old man. Bobby Brown's old band that was constructed, manufactured, in fact, by the labels to compete with the Jackson 5. And they were good as fuck. Yeah. Those labels did a great job. They really wow. did a good job, yeah. Who's the next matchup? DJ Khaled versus Jason Derulo. Oh, God, oh. dude. Two people who love to say their own names. <laughs> <laughs> Jason Derulo. DJ Khaled. <laughs> That's awesome. They might be the two people who've said their name the most of any artist ever. <laughs> Yeah. On a song. I got a record. I'm sure John Mayer says his a lot by himself. John Mayer. 
<laughs> he wakes up and Googles himself. He's talked about it. What? John Mayer said the first thing he does every day when he wakes up is Google himself. <laughs> I think he's grown past that. I think he's grown Sounds past that, sure. But yeah. He said a lot of shit I don't agree with. But goddamn, when gravity comes on, I absolutely twerk it up. I right. piss myself. After yeah. Taylor Swift dropped D Dear John on her Speak Now mm -hmm. album, I yeah. can never look at him the same. Really? Mm -mm. I look at him like this. <laughs> Three, two, one. I went with Jason Derulo. DJ Khaled, jet ski enthusiast. I went DJ Khaled. It is Jason Derulo. No. I knew it was a trick. DJ a Khaled's switch. got an yeah. album, and he's got the he's got the trumpet song that gets streamed a million times dun, all the time. Dun, 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 Cheerleader? Dun, 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 dun. No. It's like trumpets. Yeah. I think that's what it's called. And the trumpets, there you go. Yeah. And the trumpets, there you go. Yeah, and then the trumpets go. And then the trumpets go. <laughs> <laughs> What's a exactly. breakdown there, G? Yeah, this one kind of blew my mind. Jason Derulo has 31 million monthly listeners on Spotify, and DJ Khaled has 26 million. <laughs> Wow. Quick five milli on DJ Khaled for he old off. JD. Good for JD, bro. You know, the other day I went to the park and threw chips at birds. Mm -hmm. People were visibly upset. I definitely ruffled some feathers. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Jason <Yeah>. Derulo. <laughs> sure. There's nothing to do with JD. <laughs> DJ Grant, what's the next matchup? Frank Ocean versus Gunna. Oh, no. Frank Ocean versus Gunna. Neither of them have dropped anything, unless Gunna's dropped something that I just... <laughs> he dropped, like, last year. I think DS Forever last yeah. year. He's currently incarcerated. Yes. Okay. Denied bail. Yeah, free Gunna. Frank Ocean has not dropped in a long time. Mostly selling cock rings these days. Yep. His fans are loyal. They're very loyal. Yeah. I bought two of them. Is that where the 50 Gs went from the company bank account? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> 50 Gs? Yeah, we lost 50 Gs. Like, we didn't lose it. I made some investments. What was it? The cock rings? I guess you could call them that, but I think of them more as physical assets. <laughs> uh, that's not, I mean, are you using, like, you're using them? Both, yeah. Both of them, what? Yep. For, Got them on right now, boss. <laughs> Are you planning on like liquidating those assets at any point? For sure. When the value goes up. You really think that the price is going to go up on Frank Ocean cock rings? It ain't going down, brother. Eventually, it goes down. Think about the terrible day Frank Ocean passes away. Those cock rings are going to be worth a billion bucks. <laughs> a billion? Yeah. That's a lot. If yeah. that's the case, then good on you. Thank I mean, you. I trust you, but... I thought it was a smart move myself. Have you seen 8 Mile? <laughs> I know what we're doing tonight. <sighs> Three, two, one. Gonna. Frank Ocean. Frank. It is gonna. No, nice. stop, Grant. Yeah, I'm picking up on Grant's tricks. That's mm -hmm. really all I'm doing now is like, of course, they would put, you would do that. It's a bait and switch kind of thing. You know all about that with the group. I know yeah. a lot about bait and switches in real life. So, mm -hmm. you know, this is nothing. Grant, what's the whole thing? Gunna's got 23 million. Frank has 21 million. Oh, oh, come on. That's kind of upsetting to me. See, this is the part of the show they don't show either, Gabby. The movie magic. <laughs> Paramore versus the 1975. Oh, you're kidding me. Paramore versus the 1975. Maddie Healy versus Haley Williams. 1975 just dropped a new album. Yeah. However, Paramore just dropped a new single. They yes. did. Haley's my queen. Brutal. I'm a big Haley fan. She's my queen, like Jon Snow says 70,000 times in season eight of Game of Thrones. See? And that's where we can level. She's my queen. Is that <laughs> I've never seen Game of Thrones. I've only seen season eight. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. I also only watched the latest season of Stranger Things. You nice. only watched the newest one? Yep. What'd you think? It was great. See? I had a good time. Yeah. Will was a little silly. It was funny. Yeah. Silly, yeah, Will. <sighs> <laughs> I like to hang that <laughs> dork upside down. You know what I mean? <laughs> Shake out his pockets. <laughs> I used to do that a lot at school. Big bully. They must have been really tall. They were short. Yeah. Oh, yeah. so your head was just hitting the ground. No, he was the I was the shaker. Oh. I was the shaky. Oh. They couldn't shake me out for change. No way. Are you sure? Yeah, I was the bully. I was the big guy. Mm -hmm. Okay, if you say so. I'm a jock, popular guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, big mm -hmm. sports guy. Yeah, big big sports guy. Yeah. Yeah. Quarterback, I know all about center. That. Quarterback and center. <laughs> 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 Snapped it to myself. Yeah. Yeah. Really. <laughs> and it's only one person I can trust. Center and basketball. <laughs> I only trust myself to snap it to me. Pitcher and catcher. <laughs> Three, two, one. Paramore. 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 It is Paramore. Yes, finally. Yes. There, there we go. go, Gabby. Grant, what's the breakdown of Paramore? Paramore has 18 million, and the 1975 has 14 million. Yeah. yeah. Suck it, Maddie. Oh. Suck it, Maddie Healy. What yeah. The? They're the only non-derivative band from Manchester. They're so days. original and cool. Yeah. They're like Tumblr come to life. I'll rock with Maddie Healy the long way, though. He's like my favorite pretentious snob. In general. Next one. Dream versus Huddy. No way. <laughs> wow. No way. <laughs> now we're on your playground. Oh. Dream versus Huddy. Jeez. Formerly known as Lil Huddy. Did he drop the Lil? Yes. 
Yes, he he's a man what the now. Hell? Oh, come on. Now he's Big Huddy. Miss <laughs> he's Chase just Huddy. Hudson. No. You got to chill Mr. Lil even, Chase Huddy. You wrote Lil. Lil. Don't even do that. <laughs> You're not supposed to look at my answers. Lil Dream. He came out with an album, and there was a song Who? about Charlie D'Amelio. Homie Hopper. Huddy. Homie Hopper, yeah. yeah. He calls her a homie hopper. In that. Oh, and then she danced in the music video. Yeah. And now she's dating Landon Barker. Correct. Travis, Travis Barker's Travis son. Travis Barker's yeah. son. Who raps. Do you follow Alabama Barker? No. I can't believe he has a daughter named that. <laughs> yeah. <But that's laughs> His daughter's atrocious. name is Alabama. <laughs> what do you call it for short? Bama? Yeah, that actually, actually, yes. Sucks. That sucks. Imagine if your sister's name was Mississippi. <laughs> you know, I dream of a future where we can all take our masks off. Wow, profound. Three, two, one. I put dream. I put little Mr. Huddy. I put dream. It is Huddy. Let's nice, go. Huddy. Oh, what the hell? Huddy has 1,119,782, and Dream has 1,117,901. Oh, he was close. Race. How is Dream only doing, like, Dream's fans are insane. Why aren't yeah, they stream farming he's him? dropped one, two songs. Yeah, I mean, he's not a musician, right? Yeah. No, but. I mean, Huddy's like a real deal, like, to yeah. the core. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, he opened for Oliver Tree. You can't possibly be an unskilled musician. No. You gotta have the chops to get up there and perform. That's just yeah. the, the truth of it all. A cool temper, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, apparently he really holds it together. Yeah. Under any circumstance, all no that, matter the stress, all that he pressure. can take it. He absolutely can handle the pressure. And that's what makes me respect him as a man yeah. mm -hmm. and a person. He's just not the type of person who would be throwing stuff around a room and <laughs> no. a temper tantrum no. just because he can't sing. Wah, wah, wah. I don't know <laughs> how to sing. <laughs> you never do something like that. And that's never. what I like about him. And Dream, same thing. Yeah. <laughs> Very talented individual. Yeah, he looks awesome. Who I have yeah. nothing but respect for. Thank you. What? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Grant, what's the next matchup? Bruno Mars versus Nicki Minaj. Ooh, Ooh, what a tour that would be. Super freaky girl. <laughs> Nicki Minaj, Bruno Mars. Bruno Mars, a cute little son. He's from Ohio. Or not from Ohio. <laughs> Ohio? He's from Hawaii. Ohio. He's from oh. Hawaii. Really? I think he was raised in Hawaii. Interesting. It's Filipino. Yeah. Filipinas. <laughs> <laughs> so do you call people that are from Philip for the Philippines? From Philip. No, you don't. Yeah, you call them Filipinas. <laughs> I find that very hard to believe, man. No, that's it. What? Oh, I'm a Filipinas. That's what they'll yeah, say. It's like filibuster, but like Filipinas. Mm -hmm. I'll filibuster with some rounds if you try if he tries me. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, that's a guy. Don't ever cross me, all right? All right, nope, we're, this isn't being, nope. Three, two, one. Bruno. Nikki. Bruno. It is Bruno Mars. Shit. Yes. I love Bruno, too. <laughs> Th I thought with the new single that Nikki would overtake. You yeah. thought one single was going to overtake Bruno. the board song guy? Yeah, well, I, I thought that, <laughs> I thought he was just worried about Silk Sonic now. You not worry about Silk Sonic. <laughs> Why would he be worried? Bunch of Grammys. He's just you doing something. Silk Sonic. You don't think he got some residuals from that? People were like, oh, who's this little Philippines? And then go listen to his music. I broke my board with that punch. Oh, that was cool. It was cool. It was a, it was a Bruce Lee ask. What are the numbers there? Uh, Bruno Mars got 50 million and Nicki Minaj has 48.5 million. That's close. Uh, I like that Grant started off with the ones that he has to read the entire number. Yeah. And now he's broken it down to just being able to say the quick ones. Yep. That's yeah, smart work right there. I like that. <laughs> smart, smart work. What's your favorite Bruno Mars song? I think his 24 Karat album is underrated. Oh, that album fucking goes. It's underrated? Yeah. yeah. Like the one that swept the Grammys? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But <laughs> like the sure. other yeah. songs that aren't the singles. Oh, like which ones? Perm or Chunky or, or Versace on the Floor. That might have been a single. That was a good song. That was a good one. They play that in gas station all the time. Versace I absolutely have to get like. on the floor. Or what about the other? There's another slow one on the album that I'm blanking on. Saturday. Yeah. No. In, in the park. park. Yeah. It was the 4th of been July. 4th of yeah. July. Yeah, yeah. That's very much. I love Peter Cetera. What about Peter Jean Hernandez? That's, he's a, he's a baseball player. For no. the Houston Astros. <laughs> Correct. Are you kidding me? That's Bruno Mars. That's his real name. It's Peter Gene Hernandez. That's a baseball player. It is. I mean, it sounds like one. And we saw him one time. Wow. Las Vegans. Yeah. Did you know about that? The Vegans? They changed the name of Las Vegas to Las Vegans officially because there were so many vegans there, so many leftists. Oh, God. Another thing of the woke left. Yeah. No, yeah, it was all, they influence. did a press conference uh, a while ago now that uh, announcing the name change of the city officially to Las Vegans due to the influx of vegans in Nevada or Nevada.
Nevada. You can call it whichever one you want, but <laughs> you gotta call it Las it's Vegas. It's like though, pecans no. and pecans, pecans. Right. It's just like yeah, 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 yeah. just yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, Los Vegans <laughs> is the name of the city. Yeah. The artist formerly known as Las Vegas, I suppose. You know, and the, the con artist really they take it. Take it for yeah, like just like future, he was known as past, but he changed <laughs> it. Is that true? Is vegans true? Las Vegans. Yeah. I mean, obviously. Okay. Would I forsake you, Gabby? You think you take take me as a dishonest man, a guy who would lead you astray? I feel forsaken. No way. Yeah. Las Vegans, Nevada, or Nevada. Les Mis. Les Mis, great Les movie. Mis. Russell Crowe. Yeah. On my own, pretending he's beside me. That's the only song. Oh, that's I a know. good song. That's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> Grant, what is the next matchup, buddy? Fart Fest versus Sounds Dogs Love. What is this? <laughs> This seems to be a Spotify account for fart sounds versus one for sounds that dogs love. <sighs> so you gotta think about dog owners mm -hmm. with like a really mm -hmm. irritable dog who's just barking up a storm all the time or whining or whatever, and they're gonna go on Spotify and look up sounds dogs love? I don't know, I'm trying to pipe this thing down. Versus the hilarious little looking up the farts. You go, hey, I wanna hear fart. Like, oh, let me cue this on my friend's thing. Or you could like, you're mm -hmm. you're connected to the speaker out with your friends and you're mm -hmm. in the bathroom, you start playing fart farts. sounds. I feel like there's an overlap. Like there is some dogs that probably like the fart sound. That's that true. That's true, yeah, it's a Venn diagram. So, yeah. I love the video of a dog getting scared by a fart. Yeah. I also did watch our friend Dev Lemon's video oh, about yeah. poop songs. Poop songs. And how there was like an influx of, of streams to poop songs because people started getting Alexa and the like, kids would be like, hey Alexa, play poop. That's funny. And then they Alexa, went, play poop fart songs. Yeah. I'll but, activate everyone's Alexas at home. Hey Alexa, play scenes from an Italian restaurant by Billy Joel. Nice. That's gonna be awesome. Yeah. Like, yeah. I just wanted to activate that for people at home. It's an amazing song. Listen to it. Bottle mm -hmm. of red. Bottle of white, all depends upon your appetite. I'm moving out. Oh, no, that's a great one. song. Oh, yeah. Three, two, one. Farts. Fart. Doggies. It is Fart Fest. <laughs> one more for the fart girl. What's the breakdown there, Grant? Fart Fest has a shocking 107,000, and Sounds <sighs> Dogs Love has 52K. <sighs> shocking because it's not more. Go stream <laughs> the dogs today. I want to know what Sounds Dogs Love now. I'm curious. Big squeakies. Hey, but no, that would probably drive them crazy. They'd start running around and shit. What if it's like a cool sound? Like it's like, <laughs> yeah, it's like a weird. <laughs> Like a what is it, like chainsaw? A didgeridoo. Next one, Grant. The baby versus Joji. <laughs> I love Joji. If the baby has more listeners than Joji, I'm gonna poop. You're gonna poop. <laughs> <laughs> like not here, right? <laughs> well, I didn't say what or where. Okay, cool. That's what it I could I was be just, at any time. I was just checking. I was just trying to make. Why aren't sure. you gonna do that regardless? Yeah, probably at some point. Yeah, so I wouldn't blame it on the baby. You know, blame it on baby. A little baby, the baby. It's a lot of babies. A lot of whole bunch My of babies. Baby. Bunch of babies in the music industry. Too many yeah. babies. Stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop having kids. The baby. One of the most uh, interesting falls from grace I've ever seen from an artist. Like, was the biggest thing ever for a second. Yeah. And then just, like, lost the reputation and then everything. Musically, it went downhill. Yeah. It's crazy. He's the guy with the rock star song. Correct. Mm -hmm. There we go. That song's pretty awesome. This ain't no good topics. This is a clock. <laughs> yeah. That. Brand new Lamborghini, fuck a cup car. It's kind of his vibe. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Three, two, one. Joji. Joji. I put the baby. It is Joji. Yes. Okay. Oh, I just wanted great. to be on that side in case that was the answer. What were the numbers, G Dog? Joji has thirty million five hundred seven thousand six hundred one, and the baby has thirty million two hundred forty nine thousand eight hundred thirty nine. No way. By the skin of his little baby tooth. Wow, what a little baby. <laughs> wah, wah. Joji really, that's some different ascension. I've never seen one like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, From no. Making the most offensive videos you could find on the internet yep. to becoming like a well respected ballad singer. Yeah. That's right. From hair cake to bitter fuck. Never seen anything <laughs> like it. From filthy Frank versus animal rights to glimpse of us. That's something we've never seen before. Yay, <clears throat> I'm not last. You're tied for last. I'm tied. <laughs> There's only three. I'm tied for second. True. G, what's that next matchup? Frank Sinatra versus Louis Armstrong. Oh, yeah. No, that's a my alley. <laughs> Frank Sinatra, <laughs> new hyper pop artist, um, yeah. experimental SoundCloud stuff, and Louis Armstrong, lead singer of the Arctic Monkeys. <laughs> oh, this is kind of cool. Yeah, this is cool. On the sunny side of the street. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Grab your hat. <laughs> Get your coat. <laughs> Leave your worries. 
At the doorstep. Yeah, that's awesome. Life could be so sweet. Can't believe that guy was the first one on the moon. Yeah, it's unbelievable. And it would have been. I mean, I you know you want to celebrate the guy, but then you want all those bike races because of steroids. So mm-hmm. <laughs> I want to switch my hands <laughs> surgically. <laughs> what? I want to put my right hand on my left arm. That'd be so interesting. Yeah. Why? <laughs> Sounds crazy. Just to see what would happen. <laughs> are you going to flip them? Like, what's, <laughs> yep. which way are they going to face? Oh, the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> what's the wrong way? <laughs> you know, which way? My like, thumbs are pointing out. Y- well, your thumbs are pointing out, but like, is, is the top of the hand going to still be here? No. Or is it going to be? <laughs> so your thumbs will be facing the right way, but it'll be like this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. That's going to be cool. And I want to do the same thing with my two front teeth. Just flip them? Flip yep. them. I don't think a lot of people would notice, maybe. Yeah, I know. But then I'd tell them. And they'd be like, why? Whoa. And I'd be like, see? Some people are into like body, like getting implants or like uh, horns in their head or scales. I just want to do weird flipperoos. Yeah, switch it up. Three, two, one. Frank. 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 It is Frank Sinatra. The blue eyed, blue baby. Talk about Vegas. That guy invented Vegas. It's called Las Vegans now. Well, now, but when he was going, it was still Vegas. I thought he invented New York. New York. New York. Exactly. New York was very established before him. Frank's got 12 million. Louis's got 8 million. Wow. Man, that is so small for like Louis Armstrong. That's crazy. No, like keep like thinking about now though. Well, right. I bet you there's like 40 million people listening to Louis Armstrong on vinyl. Like think about it this way: Louis Armstrong's making like about as much money off of just Spotify as like bands like the 1975, who are currently releasing albums and are touring the world and are huge. Yeah, it's crazy. You know what I mean? When I think about it like that, it's like yeah. Grant, what's that next matchup? Gabby Bell versus Queef Jerky. <laughs> no. Wow. Gabby Bell, that's Gabby Bell right there. Gabby, 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 Gabby. C A B I G A B I. She's Gabby Bell. Whoa. Stream Gabby Bell on Spotify. Yeah. She's got a lot of songs in there, super fi. Queef Jerky has an album and we're on it. All three of us. Yeah, all three of us are on the Queef Jerky album. Go stream it. That's true. Is that an upside down cross? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Man, stay out of my business. Don't draw an upside down cross. <laughs> stay out of my business. What are you doing? No. Oh, you cursed. <laughs> That's not what people want to see. It's a snake's tongue. It's a serpent's tongue. No. These are the fires of the final damnation. Come on. <laughs> Next he's going to draw a giant grinding of teeth. Oh, he liked oh. it. <laughs> oh, he fully went Satan mode. Three, two, one. Gabby Bell. Gab balls. Gab balls. It is gab balls. Let's go. Let's go. Eat shit, Nick and Deb. Yeah, eat shit. <laughs> Absolute losers. Just kidding. Thanks for putting me on the album. <laughs> Run me my check, Nick. Promise me a lot. What are the numbers there? Gabby Bell has 24K and Creep Jerky has 2K. Absolutely Crush. trounced them. Yeah, clowns. Their Ooh. album does come out tonight. True, so that, that might, number that could might change. change. That number could change. I'll probably change. But hey, as of today, October 27th, 2022. I'll take the dub. Gabby Bell's got that big W on her forehead, and Dev and Nick are in the cat litter box eating cat shit. Yeah. That's where I went for lunch. The cat litter box? Mm-hmm. I heard it's good. Yeah, happy hour is nice. Nice. Mm-hmm. What do they got over there? Wet shits from cats. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what's the last one, Grant? Arctic Monkeys versus Steve Lacey. Steve Lacey. (laughs) All right. Steve Lacey. He had a, I I bite my tongue, it's a bad habit. Oh, that one. Yeah, I know that one. I want to bite yours, take a stab at me. (laughs) Versus who? Arctic Monkeys. Arctic Monkeys. Monkeys. Yeah, and Arctic Monkeys did the song, Do I Want to Know? I don't want to know. I don't want to hear any more of that. I like that song. That's my hot take. I don't like Arctic Monkeys. Damn, Gabby. First album I love. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. I love their first record. Three, two, one. Steve. Lacey. Steve. I want Arctic Monkeys. It is the Arctic Monkeys. No. I don't want to believe it. <laughs> we were tied. No, we're not. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> What are the numbers there, Grant? Uh, Arctic Monkeys has 37 million and Steve Lacey has 31 million. Arctic Lace. Monkeys, 37 million. They're much Still. bigger than I thought they were. Yeah. yeah, me too. They are not who we thought they were. Yeah. Uh, no, no. That's a sports reference. Sports reference. No, sports phone's center. Ringing. Of course sports it is. Sports center top 10. Riley's always on his phone. You don't know what the sports center top 10 means to me. Please sports. Hey, game well played. Sports. Please Thank you. Play. You might uh, liked, make it on top 10 one day. I think I will. I liked when Peyton Manning and Eli or something were mm-hmm. like on the little screen. They were doing 
doing the Manning call. cast. Yeah, every they were Monday doing, night exactly. as an alternative to the normal cast. Precisely, and I found it much more fun and interesting than a bunch of white guys in suits talking about. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather just two white guys <laughs> nice in quarter guy. zips kind of break down the game. <laughs> <laughs> I wish Stephen A. would do all sports. Oh, yeah. yeah, Diggy, when you said that she might be on top ten one. Day, oh yeah, way before you, like the Sports Center top ten. Mm-hmm. Like yeah, oh yeah, Sports Center top ten. Kind of probably like, be on tonight, honestly. Yeah. Like my golden goose, my main goal in life, and yeah, thing. but I mean, like you're not. You've lo- you're not an athlete anymore. I don't really know how many times I can tell you that. There's no chance you're going to make it on Sports Center Top 10. I mean, what about the time that I cleaned the bathroom really fast and I filmed it? Again. It was quick. I think at this point what's keeping you off is desperation. Yeah. Really? Yeah, it's it's gross. I just send tapes like everybody else. I know, but... Like earlier, I was like throwing grapes up in the air and catching them in my mouth. And then afterwards, mm-hmm. I tied my shoes really fast. Yeah. And I filmed that. I know, I remember. Like, I was the there. The shoe part, I filmed that. I was there. And I sent that in. Yep. That might get on. It won't. You just never know. It won't. I don't know. Maybe yeah. one day, buddy. All right, well, we want to thank Gabby Bell for being on the show. Our final score is 10 to 7 to 8. Everybody should go subscribe to Gabby Bell's channel and watch right all now. of her, yeah. her, her videos and do a streamer music on Spotify. Comment down below. Say, mm-hmm. we love Gabby, and we don't care who knows it. No one cares. Say, Gabby greater than Queef Jerky, but Queef Jerky greater than Lil Huddy, and Lil Huddy greater than Bare Naked Ladies post-2002. <laughs> So after the one week song. Obviously. Yeah. <laughs> Don't sing it like that. <laughs> it's been one week since you looked at me. <laughs> Make sure you like the video, subscribe, all the stuff I said at the beginning, and Diggy, please leave these wonderful people with some advice to leave her live their lives by. Cauliflowers, broccoli without a soul. All right, well, this has been I My TV. We love you, we appreciate you, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Detroit? Bye. Detroit 313, Detroit. stand up. Detroit, stand up. Six six nine. It's almost six six six. Just turn that puppy upside down. <laughs> Devil. <laughs> Fly me to the moon. Let me play among the vomit cake. One thing about me is that when I was seventeen, I got cut from the basketball team. Team. Then I played tennis because I didn't want to be a menace. And Ooh. I needed something to occupy me. Nice. Then I love I that got song. super heavy into experimental drugs. I yeah. would order them off the dark web. Hey. Yeah. And they made me really smart, but the side effects were weird. Like, I really had to fart a lot. A lot. Yeah, it was messed up.